Today, we're diving into the mysterious world of budgies, and trust me, it's more captivating than you ever imagined. Ever heard of the dark factor mutation? It's the enigmatic twist that adds a touch of intrigue to your feathered friends. Whether you're a proud budgie parent or just fascinated by the wonders of nature, this video is about to unravel the secrets behind those vibrant hues and unique patterns. Get ready for an entertaining, emotional, and highly informative journey into the hidden world of the dark factor mutation in budgies. Let's spread our wings and soar into the heart of this avian mystery. I put a timestamp in the description. See the stuff you wanna see. Understanding the dark factor mutation. What is the dark factor mutation? A genetic variation known as the dark factor mutation influences the color of budgie's feathers. The bird's overall appearance can be greatly affected by these mutations. Dark factor mutation are divided into two series or base color budgies. First one is green series or yellow base budgies and second one is blue series or white base budgies. Olive, dark green, and light green budgies are included in the green series or yellow base budgies. And these are dominant species in dark factor mutation. While sky blue, cobalt, and mauve budgies are included in the blue series or white base color budgies. And these are recessive species in the dark factor mutation. How does the dark factor mutation work? The dark factor mutation is an autosomal recessive trait, meaning that for a budgie to exhibit dark factor characteristics, it must inherit a copy of the dark factor gene from both its parents. If a budgie carries only one copy of the gene, it is considered a split for dark factor, meaning it carries the gene but does not physically express the mutation. When both parent budgies carry the dark factor gene, there is a 25% chance that their offspring will exhibit dark factor traits. However, the dark factor mutation can be masked by other color mutations, further adding to the complexity of budgie genetics. Green series or yellow base budgies. Let's continue our conversation regarding yellow base or green series budgies. Each in turn. Number 1. Light green budgie. The pale green color, which is typical of wild budgerigars, gives them a calming and visually appealing appearance, which makes them a favorite option for budgie lovers. A green series budgie without the dark factor gene is referred to as a light green budgie. Number 2. Dark green budgie. A green series budgie with one dark factor gene and one normal gene is called a dark green budgie. This causes a budgie to appear darker than it would otherwise be. The budgie may have a little darkening effect due to the dark factor gene. Number 3. Olive green budgie. A green series budgie with two dark factor genes is called an olive green budgie. The deepest type of dark factor green budgies are called olive green budgies. Given that they resemble olive green, it makes sense that they get their name from the olive. Blue series or white base budgies. We are now going to talk more about the white or blue series of budgies, one after another. Number 1. Sky blue budgie. The sky blue budgie's striking blue color is caused by the abundance of blue pigments in its feathers. A blue series budgie without the dark factor gene is called a sky blue budgie. Number 2. Cobalt budgie. Stunning variety with vivid blue plumage is the cobalt budgie. The concentration of blue pigments is responsible for its strong tint, which results in a visually arresting and exquisite feathery friend. A blue series parakeet with one dark factor gene and one normal gene is called a cobalt budgie. Number 3. Mauve budgie. The mauve budgie combines violet and blue tones in a subtle and elegant tint. The realm of pet aviculture is enhanced with an exquisite touch by this delicate and endearing color variety. A blue series budgie with two dark factor genes is called a mauve budgie. Cross-breeding outcomes and results of dark factor budgies. We shall first talk about yellow base budgies, also referred to as the green series, in crossbreeding of dark factor budgies, which are made up of budgies in olive, dark, and light green. After we conclude the green series budgies, we will talk about the blue series, or white base budgies cross-breeding results. Let's get going now. Green series, or yellow base budgies cross-breeding results. On the screen are charts showing the cross-breeding outcomes of budgies with yellow bases or green series, whereby I display every potential combination along with its outcome. Let's get started, one by one. First pairing. The male and female in this pairing are both light green budgies. The results of their crossbreeding are 100% light green budgie chicks. Second pairing. In the second pairing male is light green budgie and female is dark green budgie. Half of the chicks produced by their crossbreeding are light green budgies, and the other 50% are dark green budgies. Third pairing. 
The third pair is an olive green female budgie and a light green male. Crossbreeding produces 100% dark green budgie chicks as a consequence. Fourth pairing. The male and female in the fourth pair are both dark green budgies. 25% of the offspring from crossbreeding are light green budgies, 50% are dark green budgies, and 25% are olive green budgies. Fifth pairing. The male and female in the fifth pairing are both olive green budgies. Crossbreeding produces 100% olive green budgie chicks as a result. Blue series, or white base budgies crossbreeding results. The screen displays crossbreeding results charts for blue series, or white base budgies, in which I demonstrate all conceivable pairings and their outcomes. Let us begin one by one. First pairing. The male and female in this pairing are both sky blue budgies. The results of their crossbreeding are 100% sky blue budgie chicks. Second pairing. The male and female in the second pairing are named sky blue and cobalt, respectively. As a result of their crossbreeding, 50% of the chicks are cobalt budgies and 50% are sky blue budgies. Third pairing. The male sky blue budgie and the female mauve budgie are in the third pairing. Crossbreeding produces 100% cobalt budgie chicks as a consequence. Fourth pairing. The male and female in the fourth pair are both cobalt budgies. 25% of the offspring from crossbreeding are sky blue budgies, 50% are cobalt budgies, and 25% are mauve budgies. Fifth pairing. The male and female in the fifth pairing are both mauve budgies. Crossbreeding produces chicks that are 100% mauve budgies. The dark factor mutation in budgies is a captivating phenomenon that adds a unique touch to their appearance. Understanding its genetic basis and visual variations can help bird enthusiasts appreciate the beauty and complexity of these incredible creatures. Whether you're a breeder or simply an admirer of budgies, the dark factor mutation is undoubtedly a topic worth exploring. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about budgies and other avian wonders, be sure to subscribe to Afok Birds. Thank you for watching, and until next time, happy birding!